Uncle Claude here, and we're less than three days away from Super Bowl 58 between the San Francisco 49ers and the Kansas City Chiefs. And I'm going to give you my predictions for the game. Um, this is a very interesting game for me personally because I really don't care for either team. In fact, I really I don't want San Francisco to win because then they'll tie my Pittsburgh Steelers. And I really don't care for Peppermint Patty and the Kansas City Chiefs. But nevertheless, here we go. Here are my predictions. First off, I have to give the offensive edge so far to San Francisco. Even though they have not played one clean game yet, as far as living up to their potential on offense, they have been much more explosive than the Kansas City Chiefs. Now listen, Mahomes, as we know, is the better quarterback at least historically, but Brock Purdy, even though he has not been perfect, he has been much more explosive and has thrown the ball down the field much more than Patrick Mahomes. So I'm going to give the slight edge to San Francisco. And it's not because of Brock Purdy. It's actually more because they are more balanced with, obviously, Christian McCaffrey, who's one of the five best running backs in pro football, if not the best running back. Then you team up his receiving core because, let's face it, Mahomes' receiving core outside of Kelsey, the tight end, is mediocre at best. Now, on the defensive end, this is where San Francisco has underachieved. And I will give the edge to the Kansas City Chiefs. On the defensive end, especially the defensive line, I mean, we know that um, Chase Young has been much maligned, and rightfully so. But the rest of the offensive line, I mean, the defensive line, excuse me, outside of Nick Bosa, has underwhelmed as well. Now, the linebacking core, of course, um, Warner and Greenlaw, they've played very well. The San Francisco secondary has not. But um, Kansas City's Secondary and linebacking cores played extremely well. So I'm going to give the edge to Kansas City. The special teams, I'm going to say they're about even. Even though Kansas City's kicker has been um, more consistent, but I think San Francisco's um, return game is better than Kansas City's. So I'll call it even. My prediction, it is... I don't think it's going to be the shootout that people think that um, a lot of people think it is. It will be, but I don't. I think it'll be very close to the vest, especially um, that's what Kansas City wants, especially what we saw from these playoffs. Now, Travis Kelsey could have a big game. We know that. But who's going to be the other guy? Will it be Rice? They're going to have to throw it a couple of times down the field to Scantling. But we know his hands are not as sure as they used to be. So who's going to be that other guy? Now, Pacheco has to run the football effectively, in my opinion, in order for Kansas City to win it. We know that San Francisco's philosophy is run the football. I don't see that changing. They'll do a lot off play action. And the spotlight is definitely going to be on young Brock Purdy. My prediction is, I know that San Francisco is a two and a half point favorite. Oh man, it's going to be a close game, but unfortunately I do believe that Peppermint Patty and the Chiefs will find a way I'm going um, Kansas City 27, San Francisco 24. And that is my prediction for Super Bowl 58. Make sure to please like, share, and subscribe, ladies and gentlemen. Uncle Claude signing out. Take care, stay safe, and God bless. And enjoy the game on Sunday evening.